I want to twerk for you guys, but I don't know how, so I'm just going to turn the camera off because now I'm saying weird shit. Bye. What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, I just really wanted to sit down and chit chat and do my makeup for you guys. And today we're going to be chit chatting about why the heck I created a YouTube channel and why the heck I'm uploading videos on to YouTube. I tweeted on my Twitter the other day that I really wanted to do a Q&A video, but I don't have anybody to really ask me questions unless I post them on Facebook and my mom or someone asked me why I didn't do the dishes. But that wouldn't make for a fun Q&A video. But one girl that I used to go to school with DM'd me a question and said, what inspired you to start creating YouTube videos? And right whenever I got that DM, a spark instantly like sparked in my mind. I was like, why don't we make a video on why the heck I started a YouTube channel? So I thought it would be fun to do just a little chit chat, get ready with me while I put on some Mac up. Because do y'all see my skin right now? Mother Nature ain't playing with me. My face is like puffy. I'm breaking out so bad. Look at this. Oh, we got to cover that up. I'm not really going to go into detail about like my makeup. I'm going to have all the products that I use listed down below. But yeah, let's just get into the full chit chat. We're going to get super casual. I'm just going to be reaching in my drawers and grabbing the products that I need. You know, typical. But the first thing I'm going to go in with is my Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray because my skin needs to get calmed the F down. So where YouTube started out with me was when I was a little munchkin. I used to love watching YouTube videos. I, I like I don't even remember how young I was. I was on YouTube probably at the age of like six. Like I just loved watching YouTube videos. It was mostly like music videos and stuff like that because I just that's what us kids did in my generation back then. We just liked to watch music videos. Kids Bop, yeah, okay. Kids Bop used to actually have a website where kids could upload videos to the internet, and I did that. What foundation do I want to use? Also, I want to apologize if I'm like really like like jittery. Like this is the first time I've had a venti iced soy vanilla latte from Starbucks and I don't know how long and you know what, coffee just gets to me sometimes. Fast forward to like middle school. This is when I got into the age where I like really like wanted to make YouTube videos. I was like 14 years old. Me and my best friend at the time, Jessica, what's up girl? I don't know if you're watching this. And um, wow. And so we both really wanted to make YouTube videos and we were like, hey, why don't we make YouTube videos on the same channel? How about like a collab channel? It was called AJ Beauty Dolls. That's how you know we were young and just wanted to make a YouTube channel. Anyway, so we made a YouTube channel. We never freaking made any YouTube videos. I'm just gonna put that out there. The summer going into my freshman year of high school, I was going to a new high school. I was living in a new city, a new town. And I was like, okay, I want to start making YouTube videos now, but I never wanted anybody to know about my YouTube channel. So I never told anybody I made YouTube videos, but I made YouTube videos. If I can find some that are on my old flash drive, I will insert them right here. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing an update video and I just have a few things to update you guys about. I mean, I can't believe it's already September. Like where the heck did 2014 go? And not 2014, 2013. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing another back to school must-haves video and today it's going to be about makeup items. So these are just pretty much basic drugstore items that you probably will need for the back to school year. You know, I had so much fun with it back then, but that was also the time where I really cared what people thought about me. One thing I can say is if you are wanting to make a YouTube channel, you can't care what people think about you. You can't. I remember whenever someone I went to school with in middle school found my YouTube channel. I was at a baseball game at my new high school with some of my friends. I got a Twitter notification from this girl and she said, Aspen, is this you? I opened the tweet and it was a screenshot of my video. I cannot tell you how fast I got on YouTube and deleted my channel. I was like, never mind, I don't want to make YouTube videos anymore. I don't want anybody else to find this channel. So can we just talk about how I'm powdering my face with concealer still on my upper lip? Okay. I deleted my YouTube channel and that was the end of I don't even remember what my channel name was. Still to this day, I obviously still have the passion to make YouTube videos. I don't care if you're watching this, you know me in my personal life. I don't give a rat's booty hole if you care that I'm making YouTube videos or not. I would always like joke around with my friends like, oh my gosh, I wanna make YouTube videos. And they would all think 
no, like that's stupid. And I was like, yeah, I would play along with it. What was I talking about? Oh yeah, I even made fun of a girl at my school that did make YouTube videos. Now that I've changed my whole perspective on things like that, I feel like I was a total, that was honestly so rude of me. That was so fake of me. But girl, I know you're probably watching this. I am sincerely sorry because now we're both making YouTube videos and we're both having the time of our lives, so. And I love your videos, girl. You funny as hell. I graduated high school and I slowly started to fall off from all my friends. I think I've talked about this. Look, I messed up my hair. I, I know, I'm gonna get to why I started a YouTube channel in a second, but I wanna give y'all my background. Sorry, I got a bronze on my face here a little bit. I have different dreams that they didn't, I guess, understand. Not everybody's gonna understand why you wanna do what you wanna do, and that is fine. So. Thank God me and Des became friends. We were talking with this other girl that used to work with us and we were both talking about how we like always want to make YouTube videos and blah, blah, blah. And I was like, oh my gosh, like Des needs to be my BFF. We're so relatable. So she was like, I'll make YouTube videos if you make YouTube videos. And I was like, oh my gosh, where have you been my whole life? Okay, my brows look crazy, don't judge me. What palette do I want to use? So back to Desiree. We were like, yeah, oh my gosh, let's make YouTube videos. And here we are now. I love making YouTube videos, it is so much fun, but you're probably asking why the heck did you start making YouTube videos? And I will tell you why. Um, it's just something that, like a trait that I've always had. I love being creative. Once I graduated high school, I completely stopped caring what people thought about me. And I know a lot of people start making YouTube videos for like money and fame, and I've said this in so many, I've said this in so many other videos, though those are not my intentions at all. I make YouTube videos for fun. It's a hobby for me. Um, I love sharing my content on the interweb. YouTube has become kind of like an outlet for me almost. I'm having the time of my life right now just talking to the camera, being myself, and I think me starting a YouTube channel really shows that to myself, honestly. I think me starting a YouTube channel was something that really helped me grow. If you're thinking about making a YouTube channel, the first thing that you have to do, and if you can't do this, I honestly wouldn't rec recommend making a YouTube channel, is you can't care about what other people say. Once you start making YouTube videos, it's literally like the funnest thing ever. It's fun as the word. I know this video is so rambly and I'm still here blending my freaking eyeshadow. Why did I start a YouTube channel? Because I freaking wanted to. Many YouTube channels have freaking fun. Do what I love doing on a camera and sharing it with other people. I just think it's so fun. I really wanted to have something to do and once I picked up on YouTube, like, it started consuming my time, good time that I wanted it to consume. I'm here for the long run. I'm here to keep doing what I'm doing and doing what I'm loving. You feel me? So thank the Lord. Me and Des became friends, because if it wasn't for you, girl, we wouldn't be making YouTube videos. But yeah, now Des is bomb. BFF. It's so fun to have someone that you can, like, bond with over something you both enjoy doing. It's a great time, okay? I kind of want to use white liner, but I'm just going to go with the regular. This is purple. I pulled up the wrong liner. Like I said, I'm going to make, like, a different video on this. But if you're watching this as, like, a advice video, if you want to do it, do it, because... I honestly regret not making YouTube videos when I wanted to. Who knows where the frick I would have been now if I would have started making YouTube videos whenever I wanted to or kept my channel going. That is why I started a YouTube channel. To be freaking awesome! The people that I cared about what they thought about me are not even relevant to my life anymore. But now the friends I have now are super supportive. We all love makeup. They're down to try vegan places. Y'all didn't know I am vegan. I've already made a video on why I went vegan. So if you wanna know why the heck I went vegan, check that shit out. I'll leave it in the cards up here. And two subscribers, two million subscribers. I'm so thankful for everybody that has stuck around on my channel, everybody that's here watching this video. I love y'all. Honestly, I just can't wait to see where YouTube takes me. Um, like I said, it's truly become something that I love doing. This is the time in my life where I don't give a rat's ass. I knew this was my time. I knew that not to give up. I love talking to you guys through a camera. Well, great. I lost my train of thought. This always happens. But whatever I was saying, you get the gist. I'm going to go ahead and finish my makeup because I really don't have anything else to talk about. <laughs> I'll be right back. Once I start reaching milestones, too, I'm going to start doing giveaways. I just got freaking mascara on my face. I want to get back to my home dogs. My family grocery shopped really fast or I was just filming and talking for so long. Even though I have oily skin, I still put highlight everywhere because honestly, why the frick not? I 
think we're gonna go in with my uh, NYX Butter Gloss in the color Strawberry Jam because I love the colors like this. And this video is gonna be so long, but I hope you guys enjoy it. Yummy. Like, look how pigmented this gloss is. And for the finale, even though I'm not going anywhere, I'm gonna set my makeup. But yeah, guys, that is gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed listening to me chit chat and getting ready for absolutely nothing. But yeah, if you guys are sticking around, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below because I would appreciate that. And yeah, thank you guys for all being so positive on my channel. If you guys liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. I'm gonna stop talking now. Thank you guys for watching this video. I love you all. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.